Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Greg here. Hopefully you're doing well. As you see, I have Mophie's 3-in-1 travel charger with MagSafe. This product is $149.95, only comes in black, and it's currently on Zag.com. They sent me this out to review, so I'm gonna unbox it for you guys, get my first impressions, and get straight into it. As you can see on the box, it says that it has up to 15 watts of wireless charging, has an integrated MagSafe charger. That means you don't have to worry about bringing your own, it's already built in. Has an integrated charger as well for the Apple Watch charger, as well as an AirPod charging slot. Well, luckily, we have all three things and wanna check it out. Papers, gotta have your papers. But as you see, this is the three-in-one travel charger with the MagSafe. Comes with a nice little button, as long, you know, and an elastic. You take that elastic off, boom, this is the actual carrying case. I thought this was just the entire thing, like you just unflap it and it's just like one, one, one. But this is the actual traveling case. So this is great to know that, you know, you can just leave all the things in here if you need to and just take out the important parts. As you can see, there's a USB-C to USB-C cable right here. There is the power brick. We can just take that out. Um, this is a 30 watt charger. So you'll definitely need this to charge all three. And it's USB-C. So shout out to them for that. You have the USB-C charger as well. Boom, we can just show that. USB-C, USB-C. So shout out to Mophie for getting that right. But then you take this off, boom, you have the actual charger itself. Let's, let's just go ahead and test that out. My first impressions are it's pretty small. Um, this is what Apple should have made in that product that never came out. I forgot what it, what was it called, the Air Power. Yeah, that never came out, obviously. So Mophie, I guess they figured, you know, they were gonna be competition for them. And now they don't have any competition because this is honestly one of few that I've ever reviewed. I think it's actually the first uh, three-in-one charger that's a portable one that I can use. Um, I know Apple has the two-in-one, but this is a three-in-one. I think that's pretty dope. It has a nice like nylon material, feels good in the hand. It's easy enough to put in the pocket. Minimal branding here for Mophie, as you can see, does have Mophie's branding. This is a magnetic clasp right here. So all you have to do is boom, and it shows up. If you unbox it, and I think I have to do it the way that they had it set up. So the way they have it set up on the website is AirPods, iPhone, and then obviously your Apple Watch. Uh, everything is integrated, like I said. You lift this up. Now, I will say you have, if you have a fingernail, good luck. Uh, just don't break it, because this is a really strong lift in order to make that work. Obviously, take the sticker, you don't need that. It looks pretty nice, can't even lie. Can't lie, this is really, you know, easy to fold up and just put in your back pocket, put in your backpack. This is definitely gonna be in the everyday carry for me in my personal opinion. Uh, let's see though, um, I'm gonna actually connect this to another device since I do have a USB-C uh, USB cable laying right here. Uh, where can we charge this at? So the USB-C charging port is actually at the back of the Apple Watch. So you charge that there, uh, that's nifty. Um, I do have it charged to a 30 watt charger. We'll put the AirPods, just for anybody who's asking, yes, these are the AirPod Pros. Connect that. As you can see, they're charging. It does charge. So that, that is a big deal for me. I like that. I can honestly carry this everywhere I go, and I don't ever have to worry about extra cables and all that other junk. This is, this is really, really dope, man. Oh, my God. Also, you have right here the Apple Watch port right here let's see if this works now that okay um, this is weird now it says that it's charging but it's not completely connected to this so as you see like it keeps saying that it's charging but it's not really connected that's different um, maybe for me I just don't think that this is really practical with some Apple watch bands it does work um, I'm actually using nomads watch thing but I want to lay it flat and the reason why is because I just don't I'm not convinced that if I have this laying you know on a nightstand at night at this angle that it's going to completely charge all the way and that's just my first impression and the reason why you saw it for yourself if I have a watch band that's like this it does show that it's charging but the moment that I put the Apple watch on it it's going to disconnect and that's just me seeing that immediately so you know just know leave it flat put it on there 
and then it will charge. Now, obviously, I'm sure there's other ways that you can do this. I want to test it out just, you know, so you guys can see. If I lay it the other way, it is charging. I can confirm that. I have to check these Apple Watches too. I'm sorry, these AirPods to just make sure. So as you see, you saw the green light, turn it off. I just want to confirm that it's going to charge this as well. It says it's charging now. That's crazy. So it is charging. Of course, you have the Apple Watch that is charging as well, and you have the iPhone that's charging also. For me, for 150 bucks, I think it's a little bit pricey. Definitely a little bit pricey, but it's worth it. Uh, and the reason why I say that is because it charges everything at once. You don't have to carry around a lightning cable because I, I hate lightning cables with a passion. And I've exclusively charged with MagSafe, so it helps that it has all the three things that I carry with me every day. This is in my everyday carry. Why not add this to it? Why not add the three-in-one travel charger with MagSafe by Zag and Mophie? I personally enjoy it, and this is just me first unboxing it. I do want to travel with it on the go and see, especially since it has the fast charging up to 15 watts. I wonder if it's going to do this with every device. Like, is it going to charge evenly, or if it charges the, you know, the watch first, and then it slow charges the phone, and then you know, it slow charges the AirPods as well. Again, $149.95. If you have any questions or if you want me to follow up, please feel free to you know comment down below. Obviously, you can like the video, all that other crap. But if you do have any commentary, just leave it down in the comments and I will answer you guys. And we'll see you on the next video. Peace.